It's been a while since we read your comments, Freedom Family. Let's fix that right now. First, I make myself a little bit smaller. And let's start with Cesar, who 10 hours ago wrote, If we don't get paid for shorts, YouTube shorts until February 1st, should I hold off posting more shorts until then? How many of you are thinking the same thing? I agree, it's a good idea to hold off if your goal is revenue, but what if your goal is views and channel growth? If so, don't stop posting shorts because they do contribute to your growth. Gallup Crush wrote, I thought you need to have lots of views on videos before you can even make money on them. It's not true. As long as you are YPP enabled and monetized, you can make money off shorts. It's the same rules as monetizing your channel. Once you're monetized, everything is monetized, including shorts. Fine Gaming Connoisseur said, For many years, I've been featuring channels of what I consider to be groundbreaking and revolutionary indie games. He means focusing on the Channels tab, which I'll show you right here. On your YouTube channel, there is a Channels, a channels tab, and this is where you can feature other channels. In case you didn't know how to add channels, click that eye to see the video where I show you how to put channels into this tab. So Fine Gaming Connoisseur said, uh, from massive multinational joint efforts towards a singular vision like Star Citizen, to impressive one-man projects like Manor Lords. And by the way, his favorite game is Mortal Online 2. Why? Because it's the best spiritual successor to Ultima Online, in his opinion. What do you guys think of the channels tab? What kind of channels do you feature there? And like Fine Gaming Connoisseur, do you believe Mortal Online 2 is the best MMO as a spiritual successor to Ultima Online? Or what's your favorite MMO? I'd love to know. Tell me down there in the comments below. Coco TTV said, I will be adding some featured channels. You're always so helpful. Thanks. You're welcome. Red Roll Plays said, A decade of freedom. That does have a nice ring to it. He's talking about our ninth year anniversary, which just happened last month in December. So that's nine years of freedom. Next year will be 10 years or a decade of freedom. That'll be an exciting milestone. I'm looking forward to it. Pop Man Brad. Pop Man Brad said, damn, it's insane. I saw this guy back in 2011, 2012. He didn't have a white beard and now he does. Time flies. So I shaved my beard, but if you look back a few episodes, it's when I had uh, my white beard. It'll grow back. <laughs> Zach Tull wrote, okay. So where is the reading the comments coming back? I know you're very busy. But are we ever going to see you read comments ever again? Yes. Damn the Real Productions wrote, You got a strike, lol. He's talking about our YouTube channel, Freedom. If I go to customize my channel and go to YouTube Studio, in the dashboard, he's talking about this right here. Active Community Guideline Strike. Warning. Yes, we got a strike a community guideline strike many years ago. And it's no longer a strike. It actually never was. It was just a warning. But YouTube never takes that away. It stays there forever. It's like your one lifetime freebie. Uh, after that, any future community guidelines will count as strikes. That's their policy. It's true for all of your channels. I'm curious. Do you guys see the same thing on your channel? An active community guideline strike warning? I'd love to know. Another cool thing is this two out of 10, you're competing against yourself. In my case, I got the second most popular video, the how much money are you earning from YouTube shorts? And in case you missed it, click that eye to see this video <laughs> where Avienda, my 13 year old daughter, introduced the video. She hasn't been on The George Show for a long time. She came back for a guest appearance. I hope to see her again. And. Uh, I have four daughters, so I'll try to encourage all of them to come online and uh, you, so you can see how much they've grown. We feed our daughters well. Yes, I saw a few comments about how my daughters have grown so much. In fact, let me try to find that comment. Here we go. Tech Dunk wrote, whoa, she's grown up so much. Haven't seen videos on here for a while. And yes, she's grown a lot and I replied, we feed our daughters well. Tech Dunk also wrote, Views are also higher on shorts, though. 
someone can watch three to four videos a minute with shorts while people watching multiple minutes on normal videos. That's true. Uh, shorts do have a lot more views and let's see what the actual revenue will be in February when shorts monetization starts for all. Popcakes said, Avienda is so pretty. That's my 13 year old daughter. Thank you, Popcakes. Aditya Mandal said, now I feel old. I saw her when she was so little. And uh, to that we replied, we are all young at heart, no matter how old we get. But I hear you. All right, Freedom Family, let's stop there. I have to run. My kids are waiting for me to go roller skating. Today is Sunday here in Dubai, and we promised them to go to the park where they'll practice their roller skates. It's exciting. I remember when I was roller skating as a kid, and uh, I fell down a lot more than I, <laughs> than I care to remember. So we're here to help them, uh, you know, not fall as much. All right, Freedom Family, until the next episode, hair fixing moment. My name is George, CEO and founder of Freedom! <laughs> For freedom and the Freedom Family and Heartbeat, which is our new platform coming this year. Click that eye to learn all about what is Heartbeat, in case you're interested. And we are part of the Freedom Family. We are the Freedom Family, where we all help each other grow together as a family. That is the spirit of freedom. And now the spirit of George is to run, run, run <laughs> before uh, mommy gets upset with me. All right, take care, freedom family. Be safe, get your exercise. I went to the gym again today. And again, I was the only one in my family that did. Did you? If not, why not? You know the story. If I can go to the gym as the 47-year-old CEO of freedom, so can you. Let me be your motivation if you need it. Otherwise, get off your butt and get some exercise. You'll feel great, I promise. Till the next episode, I am George and you've been watching. Ooh, you dreaming about love. Yeah. Click that eye to partner with Freedom and join the Freedom family so we can all grow together. You get many perks like position music, you also get epidemic sound, a lot of other access to royalty free videos, sponsorships, and many things to help you grow. Just click the links down there in the description below to get involved in our community, our forums, our Discord chat servers, meet our graphics team, meet our community team, all of that on Discord and the forums. What are you waiting for? Get started. And we will grow together as a family because this is the Freedom Family. You are part of it, we are all part of it, and we're all growing together. To get more George, click that big F. That will subscribe you to Freedom Central, home of The George Show. And PewDiePie gave one of you, Freedom Family, a big shout out. Click that video to see the shout out and to see our new 3D sets for you. And click that video to see what YouTube recommends you watch next.